Hey, how's it going, guys? Well, welcome back to The Last of Us. Uh, we have secured a car. We are on our way to Tommy's to get Ellie to the Firefly. But we are in a bit of a pickle here because we are ambushed by these assholes. And now we gotta fight them off. Mm, yep, that's all the recap. So, in case you're wondering, yes, that is an asshole. You gotta die. Which is why I'm gonna put a bullet in his head. That's one way to put off an asshole, you know. Just uh, one of these life tips that I offer from time to time. I think there's there's one. I was wondering where this one got to. This is pretty smart of him to do this, you know, but not smart enough. They're really trying to surround me. Okay. See, they're actually covering this guy? You gotta hand it to the AI design of this game, I mean, at least the enemy AI. There was, there's, there was one guy that was running cover for him as he was running towards me. Which is pretty cool. Awesome. Okay. Shit, Ellie, goddamn. What did Ellie hit him with? A brick? Cuz I, I don't right. I think that's the last of them. You okay? Yeah, I guess so. Good. Cuz we need to get the hell out of here. Yeah, the you car is around, gone. See if there's anything we can use. Bill's gonna be pissed, like... We took all the pain to fix the car and now it's wrecked. There's gotta be a better way out than this. So I'm not sure exactly where we are. If, you, if anybody has that information, please leave it in the comments because I'm really curious. Yeah, a few things here and there. Sure as hell ain't going back this way. Nope. Typical video game fashion, we have only one way to go. Which is fine by me. Because I, I don't need a confusion. Hey, what's this? Alright, go. See if you can get it propped open with something. Um... Uh, pretty gnarly stuff in here. <laughs> Ellie! <laughs> Ellie, you need to hurry up. Okay, go! I thought she was go I got it, I got it, I got it. Watch your fingers! Uh, I'm always scared to see people do this. Well, they have ambushed quite a few. I guess we are the first one who actually put up such a uh, def 
a resist. Yeah. See, this could have been us. People that didn't make it. I knew I should have turned the damn truck around. We lived. Barely. Barely. Yeah. Come on, let's get out of here. I don't. I don't know if I just remember a dialogue somewhere in the back of my mind sometimes, or it's just because me and Joe really think alike sometimes. But we have some overlapping dialogue from time to time. Shoes, jacket, canteen, dry food. Uh. August 8th, nothing. Everyone too busy chasing down the crazy chick. Who? Who's the crazy chick? Hey. Smoke bomb. Oxidized sugar creates a smoke screen that will hide you from your enemies. They ignite with a concussive burst, stunning any enemy caught in the explosion radius. Enemies can't see through the smoke and won't shoot at a target they can't see. Use this to escape an overwhelmed or rush in while enemies are stunned. I wonder if it works on clickers, because they, they don't see anyway. I doubt I will be using a lot of smoke bombs. Let's see how we're supposed to be. Oh, the cave smoke bomb is down there. Got it. It took me a while to find the nail bomb. What do you know? Know what? About the ambush. I've been on both sides. Oh. Okay. Maybe that's worth a prequel. Take that as a yes. <laughs> Take it you want. I guess this is where the asshole sleep. I mean, slept. Go on. But hey, we gotta take their stuff. What is this? Medical menu improved effectiveness effectiveness of first aid. Uh -huh. So does this mean my first aid uh, are upgraded too? After I read this, I hope so. Okay, this room is definitely worth exploring. I need to use the bow and arrow from time to time. I, I really need to remember that. Here we go. I'd like to upgrade the hunting rifle. Oh, I have three clips for the shotgun now. That's definitely worth it. Not enough for anything else, I see. Except the recoil of the shotgun. Yeah, maybe that's... We were talking about a shotgun, so maybe that's worth the investment. Yep. <laughs> maybe we should have seen if we can uh, get more arrows so we can take these ones. More of an immediate need. Okay, ready to roll out. Oh, I don't think these guys were infected. Well, it don't matter. Let's just keep moving. <laughs> All right. Here's the bridge. That's our way out of here. <sighs> hey, Ellie. <laughs> Slow down. She's ahead of us. What? Right here. How about you let me go first? And keep your voice down. Okay. Joe's no fun. <clears throat> I'm whistling. 
good for you. Oh, good. Something else you can drop me crazy. Fed up with Fedra. I bet Elliot like this. Okay. <laughs> Savage Starlight Termination Shock. Uh, can I give it to her? Ellie? Where the hell did she go now? Sit tight, buddy. The apocalypse happened. What do you think? Uh, can't give it to her. She's still cleaning her knife, which is uncleanable at this point. Okay. Ellie, get down. Where did you learn to shoot? Man, you had an entire flock and you hit nothing. I'm about to hit you. Wow. Yeah, you're really upset. Well, if you want some lessons, you know, I'm more than willing to help you out. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> The hell are those guys? They're supposed to be here. No, they're on the highway shift. They're probably I'm dead. Got another batch of tourists. About to go my lucky bastards. See if there's anything you can forage while we wait for them. Ain't nothing here. Just keep going. That's right. Just keep going. What was that? Who's out there? Fuck. Oh, the other guy's coming this way. Ah! Man. Well, I think that was worth it. No, it's not. If all we're gonna get is this, but hey. We're really in the world of a few unworthy participants. I think we're just heading this pretty far. We'll yeah. get there. Well strange seeing a checkpoint with no soldiers. Well, this is what most zones look like. This place has been abandoned for a while now. Stop feeding us lies. Give us our Give rations. Us our rations. <laughs> People are hungry. We lost the Troy Hill to the most ragtag pieces of mega shit ever to carry a gun. Bastards are cunning though. They stole one of our motor launchers. We didn't stand a chance. With this and the strip district in their pocket, they now control the whole river. Made for a difficult retreat, there's barely half our squad left. I just pray to God that Jeremy and Pam are still alive to go stranded on the other side of the river. Why wouldn't they give them their food? Sometimes they ran out. Most times they just held on to it. That never happened in Boston. Trust me, it happened all the time. Yeah, it did. You'll this. Uh, you'll die before we starve. That's harsh. So this... Uh, this military zone is completely evacuated. Or slaughtered. Which one... whichever came first. You know what? How about we dash out the bow and arrow and give it a whirl? I do sincerely hope I don't regret this. Damn. 
Mm, I'm not gonna get through with them talking like this. Yeah, you better get around a little bit. But not this way, asshole. Ah, oh, shit, this is gonna be awkward. Oh, man. Okay. Let's try this. What the hell? Watch yourself. I need to I need to practice this. Um Oh, that's how you do it. I get him. <laughs> At least I shot him. What is the word for being able to f um, use both hands dexterly? There's a word for that. Andrew something, I can never remember it. I'm glad Joe is that. Aw, I can't, I can't pick it up. Go check out this area. You guys, go check over that way. How do I use the scope, by the way? There we go. There, there. Just go to sleep. Fuck. Well, I think that's all of them. That is all of them, right? Shit, no, I was not. Come on, Joe, super hearing. Aha. Uh -huh. I see you. It's like the famous movie quote. Okay, I see three dead people. That's way more than I thought. Okay. He's not gonna be able to talk. Oh, great. <laughs> you think? Well, at least this is silent. I think they found a dead body. Ah, oh, I forgot how to use it again, but you know what? It worked. Out of sheer blind luck, it worked. Hey, I, I was able to pick this one up. Ah, oh, mother. Fuck. Sorry, I was not able to properly kill you. That's it, right? There, there is nobody else. Okay. Here. 
Ah, damn it. I didn't realize there's gonna be an upstairs. We got more than that. I like my arrows back if you don't mind very much. Okay, okay, that was a, that was unfortunate. Fuck. Give me the bat. Okay, the commotion did not attract or more of them, which is good. What are you doing on the stairs? He's still there. What the hell? You dead ass. Oh, great. Mother fuck. Oh, oh shit. I need healing like desperately. So I'm gonna get in. Okay. Ali, I appreciate the effort. All right. I, I think the first aid actually does do more now that I've read that uh, handy book about it. Is that everybody? Is that finally everybody? Come on. Yeah, that's rough business. There are so many of them. Take the bow out first just because it's silent. That gun. Oh man. Shit. Mother fuck <laughs> Well that was disastrous. Okay, this guy reacted pretty fast. Mm. Aha. Surprise! He's not dead! I had it. The edge of the universe and back. Endure and survive. Excuse me. Savage Starlight. The comic I've been reading. What the hero says after Speaking of which, I have something for you. Endure and survive. Yeah. Okay. That's uh not bad, you know. I 
wish I had more room in my backpack. Oh, so you're a reader. Books are heavy. When I'm not running away from hunters and infected? Yeah, I read all the time. So, I, I guess I shouldn't expect a lot of supplies from the bookshelves. They are, you know, bookshelves. We should probably move on. Oh god, this part. Go on. I like these kind of <laughs> jokes actually. Wait. Is that it? Ah oh, shit. I, I guess I needed to be around her to, to trigger for the dialogue. Is that it? Because I was too far away and she just stopped at one. Shit. I wanted to hear more. And where the hell are we going? <laughs> Is this the way to go? Because this looks un well, uh, unexplored, not by us. Silence, tolerance, equals death. This one's... Uh, holy shit. You gotta be crazy to string up soldiers. They get people desperate enough, they'll do just about anything. And the people that rose up, they're the ones we've been fighting here? That'll be my bet. Mm, maybe another three soldiers dead. What is, what's it going to take? Give up. I don't think the military is Let's going to... Let's see where this leads us. Is going to particularly care about three soldiers, to be honest. Watch yourself on these drops. <laughs> Just being smart. And, uh, no. Down, 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 down. Get out of here. There's more of them. So this episode is gonna be entirely about slaughtering fellow human beings. Huh. Shitty human beings. No better than infected. They us. <sighs> There's our bridge. We're a little closer. I think. Let's keep at it. Uh, we're gonna have to step into this. Yuck. I can't make that jump. Sure you can. If you get me up there, I can move that plank. We'll see. Wait oh. here. See I don't goes. think we should yell. Those guys are pretty close. We're in Pittsburgh. That's where we are. It's good to know. What was it trying to show me? Anything interesting down here? Oh, fishy. Hi, little fishy. What is this? Did we get it? The tunnels can... <laughs> Sorry, Joe, I cut off your dialogue. Well, I didn't, the water did. Okay. What was 
that all about? Get on. We'll come to the hotel. Just get on. Um, okay. Oh, easy. Actually, where am I supposed to put her? I don't think I... Maybe here? Can you get up here? Right. Set up that plank like they did. We're gonna come back here. Let's ex let's explore. Stuff, 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 and you. What are you about? It goes down tonight. We're going to take the eastern checkpoint. I've stashed some extra supplies out of the Regal Apartments. It's marked with a red X. I'll keep that in mind. Actually, I'll probably forget about this. And there's some spores here. Uh, yeah, it's this pretty nasty but I think they must have taken care of the affected around this area that's why they're stationed here that's why they're even fighting for it they're fighting the military for it which is just oh, batshit crazy stinks. yeah words all run did you go to coffee shops a lot I did all the time and what would you get just just coffee yeah, growing up coffee. But also regular coffee, because those are good too. Speaking of which... Are gone? About to find out. No, they're not. It's clear, Ellie. Come on down. Oh, fancy. Uh, you ever stayed a place like this? Uh, before it all went to shit, I mean. Sure. Too high. Let's see what we can find. We just got gotta get higher. Ah, shit. Hey. Oh, I really miss coffee. <laughs> of course you do. Who wouldn't? The more I play this, the more inconvenient apocalypse is beginning to seem. Where am I taking this? I think over there. Elevators out. No surprise. Watch your step.
I have a lot of ammo. I ain't seen it quicker in weeks. That's because we're thorough. We're gonna keep being thorough. Let's wrap this up, right? All right, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> well, I I think you had a complete conversation, so you should you shouldn't feel too bad about this. Okay. Hey, how about we take a little food break? Nah, maybe in like an hour or so. Give me something before him back. Uh-huh. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> 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 Can't hear them because they're not moving around. They're just standing there. That's not good. Why do you have two bathrooms here? Seems to belong to the same household. Uh, SJTP, I don't. I wonder what that means. You choose a pretty good corner for you to rest. There are more of them. I just don't know where they are, which is pretty bad. I don't know where they all are. I can assume they're upstairs. I hope no one sees me. I hope no one sees me. <laughs> Anybody out there? Somebody to love? What am I doing? Oh, okay. See it. A pace. <laughs> I was wondering how was I still able to grab him. 
Ellie, you've seen worse shit. Shit. Um, you know what? This hasn't worked so far, so... Holy shit! Oh, that didn't instantly kill them? I'm disappointed. That dude. Ow! Okay, that was pretty close. Uh, somebody had a nosebleed here. I want to take that. Take care of that. Jesus! I'd like that gun if you don't mind. Why do I never have ammo for the hunting rifle? <laughs> Get out of the way. Jesus. Well, at least they're still together. It's not a bad scenario if you uh, form a gang in a post-apocalypse world and you take over a hotel. It's pretty ideal, actually. Can I upgrade my thing? Thank you. Oh, I'm gonna kill some fools with this. <laughs> and he didn't see Ali. Oh, there are still more of them. Oh, by the way, I need to heal. Come on, surely I must have killed every single one of them by now. I mean, I've been going around this place already. I'm just gonna follow the arrows to find this SJTP, whatever that means. Which I guess is still upstairs.
Nothing here. This place is completely set up for a shootout. Yeah, I'll clear the area. Definitely. <laughs> hey, Ali, what are you doing? What are you doing? I have a feeling that I should just follow her. I don't think she follows me when I'm deviating from the track. Hey, it looks like there's a ladder inside this elevator. That's Hold great. On, let me try to open it. Let's see where this goes. Smart. It's gonna be a tight fit, but come on. Okay. Oh boy. Find me something to climb on. Here we go. There you go. Uh oh. Okay. That that happened. That that was not. That was not expected. I'm all right. Are you okay? No. <laughs> We all need to learn to deal with our fears in our different ways. No. Stay out there. I'll make my way up to you. I'll try. Alright. Too now. Well, we never stop looking for supplies if that's any concern. Oh god. What the hell? So we have to get down first. Oh, there we go.
Thank you. Most helpful. There. Find a way around this gate. Um. Okay. How about we go over it? Hold your breath. You're going down. Well, not directly, not here. Aha! And there's nothing. Hmm. You know what that means? We need to get Ellie here to brief uh, briefing all the spores. Oh fucking hell! I am not dealing with that. Seems like they're running away from something, which bores very ill for us. Anything particular I'm looking for? That doesn't sound very good. Okay. We're getting some stuff. Hotel card. Holy shit, that scared the shit out of me. They know I'm here? How? Oh god. That's terrifying. Needs the card, I think. Uh, 
Ah, uh, okay, I, I see the problem. Um, we're gonna need to, uh, we need, we, we need electricity for that to work. And in order to do that, we're gonna need to find the generator. And in order to start the generator, we're gonna have to attract a lot of motherfuckers. So, uh... This is... I, I, I seem to remember I died a lot of times when I played this the first time. So this is gonna be very pleasant. Very educational, in fact. Where's the generator, by the way? Ah, there it is. Okay, so... S <laughs> I need to be able to uh, get to the door fast. So just to practice, I oh, start the generator, climb up here, go this way, through the corridor, and to this door. Okay, got it. No problem. This no pressure. This is like the easiest thing in the world. Just start the generator and run like hell. Like there, there's nothing simpler. All right, I got this. I got this. I totally got this. What what could possibly go wrong? I mean, with something so simple. Besides, I've already killed most of the walkers, so the the worst is probably already behind me. You know. Okay. No. Oh boy. Come after me, fuckers! Oh god! Joe? Ah! He's faster! <laughs> oh shit! Tell me the door is sealed again. So much for that. Because I'm pretty sure that the bloater does not have a key card. Holy shit. You know, see guys, that's experience. That's the difference between somebody who has played this before and potentially somebody who shits their pants. So let me... I, I am... I for one grateful that you're not seeing my first time playing that part. Cause wow, that took like two hours. Let's see what we got. Yes. Um, what was I trying to do last time? We can also up upgrade the bow. This should help us out. Why would somebody have this in their office drawer? Especially if they are, they, their job mostly involves a telephone and a computer. You know what? I'm going to stop questioning that. It's not good for my health. Ellie! At... Oh. Finish it. I got it. Nicely done. You bet. Not today. You? Not today. All oh, right. you're gonna bite it, all right? Spread out. Make sure we didn't miss any more of these fuckers. Okay. Turning around is the biggest mistake of your life. And it's also going to be your last. I'm always alternating between bottles and bricks. I can never decide. 
He seems alarmed. What's wrong, buddy? Oh. Get him. Shit. It's a good shot. He seems to be attracting more more of his buddies, so that's no. Jesus, stop already. Uh, he's far away. I got time. I shot you in the damn head. When that happens, you die. Here. What do you think you're gonna do with that plank? Got a gun, motherfucker. Again, with the uh, bottle and the uh, brick conundrum. Everlasting problem. You know, the biggest problem is I can never really remember if I have one with me or not. Oh! Good job, Belly. I shot the hell out of that guy, huh? You sure did. Sure did. Uh, I feel sick. And you just hang back like I told you to. Well, you're glad I didn't, right? I am. I'm glad I didn't get my head blown off by a goddamn kid. Come on, Joe. You know what? No. How about, hey, Ellie, I, I know it wasn't easy, but it was either him or me. Thanks for saving my ass. You got anything like that for me, Joel? He should. We gotta get going. Lead the way. Oh, come on, man. Now she's look. She looks like she's hard. Oh uh, well, not very good for with kids, but we can finally climb up there. Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> Take Dexter and uh, Neville to your mom's. Don't worry about me. Take good care of her. Don't don't worry. We take good care of her. We 
We need to get back out, find that bridge. Tell me where to go. Oh, I hate this crap. Hey, she's got a right to be sassy with you at this moment. Just this instance, you know, she... Okay, here's about... I'm about to review something weird. But I really like visiting uh, bathrooms in video games. I don't know why. Does anybody else share this sentiment out there, or is it really just me? Because I wouldn't be too surprised if it's just me. Melee combat manual volume 1 improved the durability of blades tools when binding one rigid. Cool. I hope it helps. Wow, isn't this place fancy? like a way out. Hey, you see a way to get up there? Nope. I do. Um, I'll be able to get there with this. <laughs> All right. Uh, Damn, this is not what I thought. <laughs> hey, how about a hand? You sure you can trust me with that? Ellie. Mm -hmm. uh, push. She was really helping. Damn. Push harder. There, poor, how's that? Poor piano. Let's go. Hello there. Oh shit. Come here, keep your head down. Right now, I'm gonna jump down there and I'm gonna clear us a path. What about me? You stay here. This is so stupid. We'd have more of a fucking chance if you let me help. I am. And you seem to know your way around a gun. Hmm. You reckon you can handle that? Well, I sort of shot a rifle before. But it was at rats. Rats? With BBs. Mm. It's the same basic concept. Lift it up. All right, now. You're going to lean right into that stock because it is going to kick a hell of a lot more than any BB rifle. Okay. Go and pull the bolt back. Grab it right there. Just tug it. Here you go. And as soon as you fire, you're going to want to get another round in there quick. Listen to me. If I get into trouble down there, you make every shot count. Yeah. I got this. All right. Okay. Starting to trust her. Just so we're clear about back there, it was either him or me. Yay, taking the step. You're welcome. Yeah, that's about as big of a thank you as you can get from that gruffy old man. I'm really glad they took the time to... You know, I think they walked a very delicate line with this part. Oh, shit. Guess who? Ellie! This, this is the... Time to test your shots. You oh shit! Okay, maybe that wasn't such a hot idea after all. Ha! <laughs> hot idea. Yeah, it was a hot idea, right? 
What the fuck am I doing? Um, uh, wait. Ellie really is making her shots count. I'm so proud of her. What the hell were you trying to do there? Oh my god, I'm so scarce with these bullets. Dude! Dude! Was that supposed to be a boss? You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Oh. Don't worry, Joe. I got this. You're gonna live to regret it. Where are they? Haha. <laughs> job, Ellie. She's doing a better job than I am, that's for sure. Good job, kiddo. Oh, God. I'm just, uh... Yeah, I've already started to regret this. But hey, how was I supposed to know they have reinforcements? Oh, shit. No, I don't think I'm gonna. I'm gonna find you, asshole. Fan out. Not bad. Mm, not bad at all. You know, that's one thing I'm really glad that makes me really glad that I did this is that Joe gets to constantly compliment Ellie. Which is something really nice to hear. Alright, come on down. Make a good team. High five. I do. You did awesomely. How about something uh, a little more your size? It's for emergencies only. Okay. That shouldn't be too hard on me. It's an emergency every few seconds, so. Now, now the safety's on. Uh, <laughs> do, do you know how to switch it off? I do. Okay, you just. You gotta respect it. This is not. Joel, be careful. Okay. Yeah, she's got it. Joe's like the paranoid parent. The dynamic between them is so amazing. 
By the way, I was gonna say before those rude bastards um, interrupted me was I I really love the storytelling aspect of this game and uh, the, I I I really like the character development and like when Joe was reluctant to thank Ellie for her efforts, but it's like he also feels bad about it. He just does. It took a minute for him to to take the step to admit it to himself and then to Ellie, in his way. So I, I feel like that's really revealing. It's uh, it's 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 a necessary step to you to develop the character in that in that aspect. But you don't want to drag it on, like it's. Danger, it's a dangerous route. You, you want to reveal a side of your character that's a little dark, a little not very uh, pleasing. But you, you don't want the audiences to be overly exposed to that side for too long. I mean, because people don't, you know, you have to, you still have to play as this guy. You don't want to, you don't want to play an asshole. So I, I think they, they, they kind of. Felt, uh, took the exact balance, you know, between developing the character in a negative way, but instantly, no, it, not instantly, but it didn't take too long for him to for the story to pull him back on the right track, and and now we have a character dynamic between him and Ellie that is miles more evolved than just a few minutes ago. So this is some really mm, masterclass efficient writing here. Hey, do your thing, Ellie. On it. Her thing. <laughs> Stupid chain is stuck. Uh, <laughs> okay. I am. There. Good job. It's good thinking. Help me open this. Here. Let's go. Hmm. Oh. Oh, we actually do need this. I thought it was just a precaution. We need, like, we need to close the door b behind us, but no. So for now. Oh shit, get down, get down. Nothing. That's not of course. Is it couple of That days. sucks. Whatever, man. Damn, no that truck is gonna be a problem. They're not even robbing people anymore, they just straight up kill them and search the bodies. And they have a dead guy stapled in front of the truck. I mean, what the hell is wrong with them? Oh man. Ain't nothing we could have done. I know. It's just. Oh man. But knowing Joe, probably wouldn't do anything if there was anything he could have done. You know, just. Because this is the same situation with him and uh, Sarah in the car in the beginning of the game. He he has a l girl to protect. He has his mission, and 
while he could have picked up the other passengers, there would be distractions and the potential risks he wouldn't want to take. Me in that truck. God the damn it. Wipe out the entire crew over there. You're fucking dead. Because your entire crew are stupid assholes. Okay. That went a little bit fast. But as I was saying, well, actually, I wasn't saying this, but I think this game, this, the, this, this is a very consistent theme of the game is uh, how to deal with losses. Let's read this first. We got them on the run. Most of their forces have retreated to Liberty Avenue. Come midnight, we strike. Gather every able body and arm them. If you can stand, then if you can stand, then you can fight. Anyone that refuses to fight with us will be banished. Anyone that supports the army will be made an example of. Tonight we put an end to this tyranny and start a new life for ourselves. So basically, this is a bunch of thugs that uh, that disguise themselves with ideologies such as liberty and um, resistance against the tyranny and you know all that kind of stuff. But they are just assholes, mobsters, and thugs. Yeah, that that could happen. But as I was saying, it's, the game is very much about how to deal with losses, and we we've seen examples of that. Uh, like J Joe, he's uh, he, he he's all about. Wow, that's a little symbolic. Joe is all about forgetting, not forgetting, just never mentioning the people he lost again. He forbids anyone to even insinuate about Sarah. Uh, and he refuses to allow Ellie to talk about Tess. And he doesn't want Bill to talk about Tess either. Bill doesn't even fucking know. Okay, they have traps here. That's bad. This place is rigged. Also, we have Bill. You know, Bill is Bill is even more about alienating people, and he verbalizes them. He keeps talking about it. He tells Joe the story about him wisening up and not. Joel, I I know. I think I'm a blind alley. But the thing is, Bill, he's. The way the the reason I think he's keeps talking about it is that he is because he really doesn't feel that way. He's trying to convince himself more than anybody else. Because minutes after he talked about how he, you know, lose the burden of his old partner, we found out that he, that is actually his partner actually left him. Yeah. I just watched the mob douse Captain Mastro's and the rest of my team in gasoline and I burned them alive. The, the animals were actually celebrating. Some old fucker complained it was a waste of gasoline. There were too many of them. All I could do was slip away, but I remember all their faces. Gonna hunt each one down if I have to. Good for you, but I'm gonna do your job for you. Come on. Don't gather around like this. If you want to gather around, the, maybe a group huddle will do. Then I will give you the old uh, flammables. But not like this. You're like too far away. So I was saying, uh, no, I don't think. Okay. He's back. Maybe we could just attract them all to one place. Is, is that gonna work? Come 
Come on. I'm gonna look out here. Okay. That is backfired. No, it hasn't. It has surprisingly worked to our favor. So as I was saying, Bill, you know, I keep trying, I want to make a point, but reality keeps stopping me, keeps interrupting. Holy shit! There's an over here. Hey, spread out! Yes, spread out, please spread out. You too, that means you too. This is not spreading out, you're just standing. Ah, sh shit. Great. Ah, where'd you come from? Good job, Ellie. As always. Where's the mammal? Thanks. Great. I do need those. Oh. I can't get that thing. Wow. Ways out of this. He's gonna turn around. He's gonna turn around because there's nowhere else to go. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh yeah. Hey Joe, you happy that you uh give Ellie a gun? Cuz I am. Oh, and a comic book thing. Ha. Well, that's Okay. We finished the scour in the city for any survivors. There were a handful of soldiers hiding in the hotel. We took care of them. A bunch of us raided their stockade, or what was left of it. Most of the big machines got fucked up in the fighting. We won't be riding a tank anytime soon. Likewise, none of the heavy artillery is salvageable. The one exception is the Humvee. We've managed to repair it, including the 50 cal mounted gun. This thing is impenetrable. I'd like to see someone fuck with us now. Yeah, you, you, you gotta... Expect that most of the military stuff are broken up in order for them to be taken over Because These guys will never be able to take care of uh, to take over take over this place if the military has a viable tank available
I'm gonna replenish the shiv here. And this room is gold. Still, still have some distance ahead of us. Let's go through the alley. What are they talking about? You have 25 cans of bacon? Yeah, we don't want to mess with them when they have the armored truck on their side. There's no way to go back here. This sucks. This sucks all around. Hey you. Hey you. Guess who's lucky? Jeez. So Joe's superhero does not include a tank. I mean it's not actually a tank but I think it's safe to call it that. Where are we going, by the way? Seems we have to confront these people. Obviously, I want—I don't want that thing to see me. Okay. I think we're good. Good is a relative term, but I think we're good. Are we? No, no, we're not. Okay. Get away from her. Yeah. That truck's gonna be a problem. Bigger problems, I'm not exactly sure where we are going. Okay, he's covering us all around.
How about we finally use this? Uh oh! I thought I was hot shit! Oh god. Jesus, this is intense. Well, the game has always been intense, but damn. Is it gonna know you're upstairs now? I should heal again just to be just just to be certain. Oh no. I can't craft another this is bad. Why did they block the, the, the bathrooms? That'll do. Wait, what will we do? Oh, she gave me ammo. Good girl. And you didn't want to give her a gun. Shit, 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 shit. I think we lost him. We did. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> he looks like he's been shot a few times. Oh god, you're kidding me. We're okay. They can't see us. Well, just be glad of that. Take it easy. It's all right. They're not the bad guys. L lower the gun. Oh, man, you hit hard. Man, well, I was <laughs> trying to I kill did. you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I thought you were one of them too. Then I saw you. If you haven't noticed, they don't keep kids around. Survival of the fittest. Oh. You're bleeding. That's ah, just nothing. That seems pretty short-sighted. I'm Henry. This is Sam. I think I caught your name was Joel. Ellie. How many are with you? They're all dead. Hey, we don't know that. There were a bunch of us. Someone had the brilliant idea of entering the city. Look for supplies. Those fuckers, they ambushed us. <clears throat> Scattered us. Now it's all about getting out of this shithole. We can help each other. Ellie. Safety in numbers and all that. She's right. We could help each other. We got a hideout not too far from here. Be safer if we chat there. All right, take us there. Follow me. Road trip. Okay, I think this is a good place to stop. We are no closer to Tommy's. Uh, we've been trying to deal with uh, these thugs, this band of... 
I don't even know what to call them. They're either a militia or they're just bad people. We've been trying to deal with them this whole episode, and so the, the big, the biggest progress, uh, story-wise, obviously, is Joe and Ellie's relationship. And I think I've elaborated enough on that. I was trying to say earlier that both Joe and Bill they are, have a habit of putting distance between themselves and other people, but neither of them actually want that. Joe certainly had a relationship with Tess. Her death seems to be breaking his heart. He's still brokenhearted about his daughter, and these experiences, these losses, are uh, making him push people away. Bill is kind of the same thing. He's all hardcore survivalist, uh, that type, but he still wants Frank around. Uh, he's he look he's like all tough shit. Oh, I I wisened up. I sent him on his way, but it looks like Frank didn't. Frank, first of all, Frank ditched him, and it doesn't look like Frank ditched him a long time ago. So he hasn't actually been living by himself all that long. He's just trying to appear that way. And Frank's departure certainly ha will push him further down the path. And I think that's. But even even Joe doesn't kind of want to uh, acknowledge that. Like when Bill was trying to say. You should keep your distance. I mean, in all sense and purposes, Joe actually agrees with him in that philosophy, but even he doesn't want to hear it, because neither of them really wants to live that way. But that's enough analysis for here. Uh, we have met two new traveling companions, and uh, we're going to their hideout. So, see you next time.